Now to an extraordinary upset in Scotland last night where sixth tier Darvel stunned Aberdeen in the Scottish Cup. Let's get more on that story with our reporter Luke Shanley. Well, I have to say, I absolutely love my job. Look where they've sent me today, the World Championship Scotch Pie Awards. This is fantastic. It's like Willy Wonka and the Pie Factory here. I can't believe it. It's fantastic. But we also love Scotch pies in Scotland, but we also love a Scottish Cup shock. And by the way, what about the Cup shock last night? Darvel of the West of Scotland Premier Division beating Aberdeen. And delighted to say the Darvel president is alongside me. We'll get to pies in a minute, John, and we'll, yes, we'll explain right. why we're here. But just firstly, um, what about last night? Talk us through it. Oh, it was just absolutely amazing. You know, I, we all thought about it. Could we beat Aberdeen? Yes, we could we try and beat them. We're all a small club, six tier. But, you know, the, the West of Scotland Football League, where we play, is, is one of the best leagues in Scotland, most competitive. It's got all your brilliant teams. Ock and Lake Talbot, you know. Ock and Lake Talbot been a great team for years. They're still a fantastic team, you know. But you've got your other teams, Pollock, Clyde Bank. Um, you know, and, and for us, uh, is it a shock for Ock and Lake for, for them to, th to see what we have done and what they have done? They beat Air United. Yeah, it's, it's just a, another great result for the West of Scotland football clubs. What about the atmosphere and the, the fact you had a, a sellout in the community all behind yeah. you? Uh, the, the, the atmosphere was fantastic. You know, it was uh, the be best I've ever had at Darvel. Uh, but, you know, I, I did get brought down to Earth a wee bit at the end of it all when. You know, I'm trying to chase all the cameramen out the place and everything like that. So, you know, three or four of us still had to lock the club up at midnight last night. So, and then uh, back up here at Cumberland today for, for the Pie Awards. What about the next round now and, and the ambitions in the Cup this season? Well, you know, we're trying to increase the ground capacity for the next round. Once again, we're going to keep the game in Darvel. It has to be in Darvel. Why, sh why should it not be? Why should I move to Kilmarnock? Um, no, we're going to keep it in Darrow. Next round, get Falkirk. Mm, you know, well, anything's possible. If we can beat Aberdeen, we can beat Falkirk. But uh, it'll be a difficult game, but we'll, we'll, we'll take it one game at a time, you know. Where are we going next? Well, we're going to Arthurley on Saturday. We'll get them in the West of Scotland League uh, up at Barhead in Glasgow. So that brings it back to, to the real focus of the league. But what is the ambitions of the club? Well, the ambitions of the club is to move up the pyramid. Well, you know, we started, when I took over the club, we're in, uh, uh, we're in ninth, league, league nine. We're now in league six. And uh, we want to make it an easier route to get out of each route, route uh, league six because the winners of our league has got to play the winners of East Scotland League to get into Route 5. We think it should be automatic promotion. There's a lot of great clubs in our league who, who would um, make League 5, which is the Lowland League, a lot better league. Um, we feel as if we're a lot better teams uh, in the East and the West and watching the Lowland League. So unless the SFA can get round, and get round the table and, and uh, possibly... Uh, change something about the way the, the pyramid structure, structure works, getting one or two teams promoted. Um, but we want to get into the, the second division, into the first division. You know, Kelty have done it, Bonnie Rig Rose have moved up, uh, Cove Rangers have done it. So we want to be the next team like that. Yeah, and you proved last night what you can do. Now, we're here in Cumbernauld. Ivan, if you wanted the camera operator here, show us some of these pies here. It's fantastic stuff. Uh, John, what are you doing here today at the, the World Championship Scotch Pie Awards? Well, this is the Scotch Pie Awards. It's held uh, every year in January. Um, last year I won it, so I'm, I'm, I'm the World Pie Champion as well as the, um, you know, been the Scottish football most uh, uh, biggest shock in the world. So um, it's my pies that everybody will eat for lunch today and then after the awards we'll find out who the winner of this the world champion is this year. We'll also find out who's got the best football pie in Scotland, and I hope that my commander pie wins that. Well, this could be some double for you in the space of two days. Yeah. A, a cup shock and, a, and win the World Pie Championship. Yeah, if I do that, and my grandson, my youngest grandson, Leo, is one today. So it'd be, it'd be amazing if it, that's a wee treble, you know. We're going down to see my grandson later on after the awards and to celebrate his birthday. Now, this is fantastic. Now, is there any secret recipe that goes into these pies? Oh, the, the pies is, it, it's, you know, f for us it's quite simple, you know. It's uh, getting the right choice of meat, uh, the beef with it, uh, and uh, just the right, the right amount of seasoning, rusks, fire properly, a nice lid on it, and, uh, and I think it's a joy to eat. Well, I've, I've won it twice, so um, and could this be two years in a row this time? Well, I hope so. We're going for two in a row. Uh, just before we let you go, who did I speak to to try and get on the judging panel? 
oh, I don't know who's in the job. You know, we've had uh, certain celebrities on it, we've had Tam Cowan on it, we've had Jim Leishman on it. So I think, like uh, yeah, I think you will need to uh, speak to the guys and see how they manage to wrangle onto it once. Well, look at the size of me. I don't think uh, another couple of pies will do me too much harm, but certainly we'll have to try uh, to make sure that um, the quality control is good enough here. So delighted to be in the inner sanctum here in Cumbernauld. And we'll, we'll update you not only on uh, Darvel's progress, but who wins the pie championships today?